Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Today is 25th September 2023 and in this video we are going to see the important current affairs. Our first question is, which of the following day is celebrated as World Rhino Day? And sir is option number 1, 22nd September. Every year, 22nd September is celebrated as World Rhino Day. This day is a global initiative which is celebrated to raise awareness about the critical plight of the rhinoceros species and to advocate for their protection. So answer will be option number 1, 22nd September. This is World Rhino Day. If we are asked which day is celebrated as World Tiger Day, then uh, 29th July is celebrated every year as International Tiger Day. World Lion Day. World Lion Day is celebrated on 10th of August every year. World Elephant Day. World Elephant Day is celebrated on 12th of August annually. And World Sparrow Day. World Sparrow Day is celebrated on 20th March. 20th March. So, our main question, World Rhino Day, answer will be option number 1, 22nd September. Next, Governor of which of the following state has recently unveiled the logo of Kala Kranti Mission? Answer is option number 2, West Bengal. Governor of West Bengal, C.V. Anand Bose has recently unveiled the logo of Kala Kranti Mission in Kolkata. Kala Kranti Mission. This mission is a unique initiative to appreciate and celebrate the rich diversity of West Bengal's cultural tradition and arts and crafts. Uh, cultural traditions and arts and crafts. So, answer will be option number two, West Bengal. West Bengal, this is West Bengal. Its capital is Kolkata. Governor is C.V. Ananda Bose. Chief Minister is Mamta Banerjee. Its legislature has 294 members. 42 members are elected to Lok Sabha and 16 members are elected to Rajya Sabha from West Bengal. West Bengal is the fourth most populous and 13th most largest state by area in India. It borders with Bangladesh, Nepal, Bhutan, Odisha, Jharkhand, Bihar, Sikkim, Assam, Ganga, Hooghly, Damodar, Bhagirathi and Mayuraksha are the main rivers of West Bengal and Kathi is the cultural or uh, classical dance form of West Bengal. Next question is, Yuddha Abhyas is a joint military exercise between India and Dash. Answer is option number 4, USA or America or United States of America. Yuddha Abhyas is a joint training exercise between the Indian Army and the US Army, which aims to exchange best practices, tactics, techniques and uh, procedures between the armies of the both nations. And in 2023, the 9th edition, the 9th, uh, 19th edition of this exercise is being or will be organized from September, from September 25th to October 8, 2023. Answer will be option number 4. Uh, Yudha Abbas is a joint military exercise between India and USA. Next question is, which of the following state government has recently awarded a club award to Palak Sharma? Answer is option number 1, Madhya Pradesh. Recently, Madhya Pradesh Chief Minister, Madhya Pradesh Chief Minister Shivra C.H. Chavan has presented a Klave award to the Palak Sharma. Palak Sharma is a remarkable young driver from the Indore EMP and this award called a Klave award is one of the highest sports awards of, of Madhya Pradesh state government. Recently this award has been given to, uh, given to Palak Sharma a driver from Indore, Madhya Pradesh. Next question is, which of the following state government has become the fourth state in India to have e-cabinet? Answer is option number four, Tripura. Tripura government has decided to go for uh, holding a paperless meeting of the Council of Ministers, which will uh, fully automate uh, the automate as a part of uh, digital uh, digitalization uh, program of the administration with this tripura state government has become the fourth state in india to have e cabinet after uttar pradesh uttarakhand or Nadir pradesh answer will be option four tripura tripura this is tripura this is tripura in the indian map its capital is agartala governor is satyadunarayan arya cm is manik shah its legislature has uh, 60 members. Two members are elected to Lok Sabha and one member is elected to Rajya Sabha from Tripura. It borders with Bangladesh, Assam, Mizoram, Gomati and uh, Khowai are the main rivers of Tripura. 
next question is which of the following state government has recently launched mobile van program to promote environmentally environmentally friendly farming in the state answer is option number three himachal pradesh mobile van program has been recently launched in himachal pradesh by the himachal pradesh agricultural department and this uh, program or this mobile van uh, program has been launched to promote environmental friendly farming in the state this mobile van program initiative will reduce the cost of farming increase income and safeguard people from the negative effect of the chemical agriculture on humans and the environment and so will be option number three this mobile van program has been recently started by himachal pradesh state government to promote environmental friendly farming in the state next question is who among the following has been awarded the icc player of the month for august 2023 this award called icc player of the month award for the month august 2023 has been recently awarded by icc that is international cricket council to barber azam and arlini kelly arlini kelly is an Uh, women's uh, women cricketer from ireland women women cricketer from ireland and barber azam is a pakistani main cricketer and uh, both one and two have been recently awarded with this award called icc player of the month award for the month august 2023 barber azam has been uh, given this award in men's category and uh, arlini kelly has been awarded this award in female category next question is Pramila Malik has recently become the first woman speaker of which of the following states legisl legislative assembly and sir it's option number 1 odisha recently bjd or senior bjd leader pramila malik has been or has became the first woman speaker of the odisha legislative assembly she was elected as the speaker of the house on the first day of the monsoon session on opposed answer will be option number 1 odisha odisha this is odisha its capital is bhuvneshwar governor is ganeshi lal chief minister is navin patnaik its legislature has 147 members 21 members are elected to lok sabha and 10 members are elected to rajya sabha from odisha it borders with west bengal jharkhand chatisgarh and andhra pradesh and mahanadi is the main river of odisha next which of the following day is celebrated as world rose day and said is option number 3 24th uh, sorry answer is answer is option number 2 22 september answer is 22 september every year world rose day which is also known as this day is also known as day for welfare of cancer patients world rose day is also known as day for welfare of cancer patient and this day is celebrated every year on 22 september it is celebrated to encourage and acknowledge acknowledge cancer survivors all over the world and this day is a symbol for or symbol of hope for cancer patients answer will be option number 1 22 september next question is which of the following day is celebrated as international daughters day annually answer is option number 3 24th september international daughter day is celebrated on 24th of september every year this day is celebrated to honor and appreciate daughters and the role they play in uniting family and to advocate for equal opportunities and love of love for girls and daughters answer will be option number 3 24th september is celebrated as international doctors day annually now we will quickly revise the questions of our last video our first question was international lawyers conference 2023 has been recently organized at which of the following places answer is option number 1 new delhi what will be india gdp growth rate in the current financial year as predicted by the union home ministry of finance and series option number 2 6.5% which of the following day is celebrated as international day of sign languages and series option number 323rd september next antim pangal has won dash medal in the world wrestling championship 2023 and series option number 3 bronze medal prime minister of india narendra modi will inaugurate dash vande bharat express on september 24 2023 and series option number 3 9 sixth question was india has ranked dash in recently released 
ICC ODI ranking and said is option number one first. Seventh question was which of the following bank has recently launched a transaction banking platform new for enterprises for MSME and said is option number two Axis Bank. Eighth question was the 20th National Book Fair or Festival is organized in Dash. It is organized in Lucknow and said will be option number two. Ninth question was who among the following has been elected or selected as selected for the Norman Borlaug Award 2023? Three. Recently, Sauti Naik has been selected for this Norman Borlock Award 2023. And 10th question was Which team has won 2023 FIFA Women's World Cup? And said is option number one Spain. Spain has won 2023 FIFA Women's World Cup. Now, uh, and this was the question asked to you in the last video. Question was which university has won the most medals in the recently calculated third Kelo India University Games? And said is option number one, Punjab University. Third Kelo India University Games 2023 were recently held in Uttar Pradesh from 25th May to 3rd of June 2023. And Punjab University has won overall championship of the third Kelo India University Games 2023 with a total of 69 medals, which includes 26 gold medals, 17 silver, and uh, 26 bronze medal and so it will be optional one Punjab University now today's question question is which of the following days is celebrated as World Environment Day annually options are 4th July uh, sorry 4th June 5th June 6th June and 7th June if you know answer of this question you can write it in the comment section below or we will discuss question in the next video